morning. Welcome once again to Mike's pre E3 Extravaganza. If you haven't watched the other episodes, then uh, the links will be in the description and I'll put one of those wee card things or whatever they're called up top. So we can check those out. Let's jump right into Nintendo. They are doing a showcase, which is the name of their new Direct, on the 13th of June. What we know. It's going to be a Super Mario Odyssey special. I'm really hoping this isn't like last year with Breath of the Wild. But at least in this scenario, I actually like Mario games. Even Sunshine. We're getting ARMS and Splatoon 2 tournaments. Not quite as good as a few years ago with the Nintendo World Championships, but I'll take it. The Mario X Rabbids game that's been leaked, confirmed, denied and everything else, I'm expecting a big reveal. Well, I say, it's actually not that much. Let's move on to what we expect. Mario & Luigi Superstar Saga DX. It's been data mined and talked about, and I can't wait. Superstar Saga is honestly one of the best games I've ever played, and to have a chance to play through it all over again? Minted. Absolutely minted. Now, I know they've said it'll be a Switch-focused event, so I'm guessing this will be a low-key treehouse announcement. Xenoblade Chronicles 2. We're getting new info about it, and a reassurance it'll be out this year. Swell. With the impending release of the new 2DS XL, I figure they will at least mention it. Maybe show off a special edition? I don't know. It's probably unlikely. We're probably going to get to see that new Kirby title they've talked about. I mean, it is his 25th birthday this year. Finally, Retro's new IP. Let's finally talk about it. Right, with that out of the way, it's time for the DREAM announcements. And to do that, I'm going to bring in a special guest. For the first time on Mike's Mike, it's Lorenzo! I'm so excited! How you doing, man? Hey. 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 <laughs> Fuck. Right. Let's just get this out of the way right now. Smash Brothers port for the Switch. Just give us all new DLC and more characters. Bring back the Ice Climbers and Snake and K. Rool. How cool would that be? Oh, and Shovel Knight. And combined all the levels from the 3DS and Wii U versions. A definitive edition. Get it done! A new Metroid Nintendo. This time starring Samus Aran. It's not a lot to ask, and no one wanted Federation Force. But that game wasn't even balanced for a single player experience. That's the one thing Metroid is known for. I mean, come on. An HD remake of Paper Mario The Thousand Year Door. Just imagine for a moment how good that would be. Or a straight sequel to it. But a Paper Mario RPG again? Oh yes. Just took it to my veins! A new Donkey Kong Country game featuring K. Rool and the return of the Kremlings. As much as folk love the Retro Returns series of games, I think few would argue that the enemies have anything more than a fraction of the personality the Kremlings did. Just bring them back! If the Mario X Rabbids game got the rights to Geno and Mallow from Super Mario RPG, I'd be buying a Switch right now. F. Fucking. Zero. Just bring it out! 
Fast RMX and Red Hound don't fucking count! Diddy Kong Racing Sequel Because I want it Joy-Con Variations I want Super Nintendo Joy-Cons GameCube Joy-Cons Nintendo 64 Joy-Cons Give me as many varieties as you can, but make your games compatible with the standard ones. Oh, and give us something substantial to show off the HD rumble. Maybe a remake of Mario Sunshine? Hmm? Pikmin 4. It's been said it's been in the bag for years. Well, let's see it. Localize mother fucking three. It'll never happen at this point, but it should. And we should get a fourth. Mother, Earthbound, whatever. Give it to me. Also, put Duster in Smash too. That guy's cool. Look, that's enough. Nintendo needs to do very little of these to make a good impression at E3. But looking at the wants of fans, and Nintendo's willingness to go against that, we could be in for a rocky ride. Hold me, Lorenzo. But those are just our opinions, guys. Thanks for listening to them. What are your hopes and dreams this E3? Leave a comment below. And subscribe. I've got one more E3 video coming out. Ooh. And then after E3, we'll get a wee podcast with the two of us. That's worth it. Yeah, that's very good. That's nice. But yeah, until then, guys, I'm Mike. I'm Lorenzo. This is Mike's Mike. Catch, Catch you all later. later.